So, this is the pine phone. Ah, oh, that's me! Uh, <clears throat> I guess it's dead right now. I can't even turn it on. I've had it plugged in, trying to charge for some minutes now. It's still not turning on. This red uh, LED up here turns on. But nothing happens! Uh, <clears throat> uh, it's, it's pretty thick, you know? It's got some girth to it. Hold it in my hand. There you go. Little pine cone, pine design. Then I guess the speakers are there. Uh, headphone jack. <clears throat> this is USB C, obviously, because of the dock over there. Um, yeah, <clears throat> I guess this thing on here is a screen protector. I was concerned because of like the Galaxy Fold, you know, like people peeled this stuff off and it broke the screen. So I was like, hmm, should I do that or not? <clears throat> so far I haven't peeled it off. I might take it off, but I haven't tried. I probably can't see this, but the manual says, uh, <clears throat> wait, maybe you can. Your pine phone arrives with a plastic strip. Place between the power connectors and the battery. So that's why I won't do anything. Well, I want to work. So I'm gonna try that. Yeah, so there it is. <clears throat> I don't have a SIM or an external SD card right now, so I'll have to just use it as it is. Yes. Yes! Where's that little cursor on the K? Oh, there we go. Oh, that's sick. What is this? It's in freaking landscape. I cut my thumb opening this box. Look at dunce. There. There's a pin. Oh, God. <laughs> What is this? Zero, zero, zero? Oh my god. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh shit. Enter. Oh my god, what is the pin? I don't know. Apparently this is not supposed to happen. You're supposed to like create a user and pin or something. Somebody said the Manjaro pin is six. One, two, three, four, five, six. I mean, this is KDE Plasma, but we'll see. Oh, <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this is neat. Maybe it's... Oh, yeah, yeah. So it is... It was a thing. That's not bad. Look at that. Mmm. Mmm. Mmm-mmm. -mm. This is a good cell phone. Uh, okay, so I'm going to dock it and see if I can get a terminal going and we can run like each top and whatnot. <clears throat> I don't know what's going on right now. Freaking out. This sounds coming from the dock. Um, it's not plugged in, so I wonder what's happening. This is powering this keyboard. Hmm, that's interesting. So I plug it into my socket, and it's fine. <clears throat> Maybe it's like, uh, trying to pull power from the phone. Interesting. The display in the room. It says 27%. Yeah. I'm going to charge the phone a bit and then I can plug it in longer. As a really bad angle. Sorry about that. You can see it's a terminal though. I'm trying to see if I can turn the external monitor on or something. So I've now uh, switched to Mobian. Um, I got an SD card. 
downloaded the image and flashed it with Etcher. And I just popped it in, booted the phone, worked automatically. There it is. KDE was using one gigs of RAM. One gig. What is that? The quad core? I guess that makes sense. Four lines. <clears throat> it's using 800 megs. Could probably drop that down to like 400 or something with i3. HDMI. Nice. Cool. Tired of your phone operating system? Get yourself a can of pee. It's good when it's cold. This is a <clears throat> Mobian. I'm installing a light DM. I did it through the terminal on the phone. I guess it's done. Oh, uh, yeah, it's parked. Where did it go? So I will uh, preface this by saying that it is easy to criticize like software that you didn't develop. Because, you know, like, words are cheap. Uh, anyway, so this is a uh, SXMO. And, uh, I mentioned like I don't know if it's true that there's no cursor yeah like you can't tell what input field you're in and like tab doesn't work and uh, so far I figured out double tap opens the terminal and then uh, push up you can access some stuff and then you can go deeper into a uh, system menu and that shows like apps scripts files but i was trying to get the monitor to turn on i think i can with x render assuming it's there <clears throat> 